Carcinogenesis. The body features a number of complex organ systems. Organs are made of specific types of tissue, which are composed of cells arranged in an orderly fashion. Each cell contains genes made up of sequences of DNA. These genes determine various cellular properties, such as the function and lifespan of the cell. A change in the DNA sequence, called a mutation, alters the way a cell performs some of its functions. This mutation may be a trait inherited from the mother or father, or it may be a spontaneous change that occurs over the course of an individual's lifetime. In addition, carcinogens, such as radiation and a variety of chemical factors, can cause changes in DNA. Normal cells grow, multiply, and die on a regular controlled basis. While a cell grows, the DNA contained within the cell is duplicated. The cell then divides in half to create two new cells by a process called mitosis. This division process is controlled by multiple factors. Two specific types of genes control cell growth and division. Oncogenes act like on switches and give commands for the cell to grow and divide. Tumor suppressor genes tell the cell to stop growing and dividing, similar to an off switch. If damaged, oncogenes may give a continuous on command. Similarly, damaged tumor suppressors may not give an off command. These errors will allow the cell to grow and divide uncontrollably. In addition, growth factors such as hormones modulate the proliferation of cells. The body naturally controls these growth factors. However, external factors such as chemicals that mimic or change amounts of growth factors can alter these processes. Overexpression of growth factors is associated with increased cell division. Without repairs to damaged oncogenes and tumor suppressor genes, or with increased amounts of growth factors, there can be exponential growth of damaged cells, 